Hi guys, it's Sharon here. I'm um, going to read you guys the story of Goodnight Harry by Kim Lewis. Uh, I'm going to talk a little bit about genre. I want you to think about what kind of book this is. And I will tell you at the end. If you don't know, um, this is a story about a little stuffed animal named Harry. He's the elephant. And he can't seem to fall asleep. And he tries everything to fall, to try and fall asleep. And he really, really has a hard time. Let's find out if he falls asleep and if he does, how. Good Night, Harry by Kim Lewis. Harry, the elephant, was getting ready for bed with his friends, Lula and Ted. Good night, everyone, said Harry. Ooh, went Lula. Snore, went Ted. Harry lay waiting, but sleep didn't come. Have you ever had that happen to you when you just can't fall asleep? I forgot my bedtime story, thought Harry. He opened his books. He looked at the pictures. He looked at the words. His eyes grew heavy. He snuggled down again. I'm waiting, he said, but sleep didn't come to Harry. Maybe I'm not really tired, thought Harry. He hung up his clothes. He cleaned up his room. He ran in place. He touched his toes. He hopped on one foot. He jumped up and down. Then Harry got back into bed. Ooh. Went Lula. Snore. Went Ted. I'm waiting, said Harry. But nothing happened. Maybe I'm not really comfy, thought Harry. He stretched out one way. He stretched out another way. He lay on his tummy. He lay on his back. He closed his eyes tight. Zzz, went Lula. Snore, went Ted. I'm still awake, <sighs> sighed Harry. <clears throat> then Harry began to worry. He worried and worried. He just couldn't stop. He thought about tomorrow. He thought of today. He thought about nothing. He thought about lots. He wiggled and squiggled. He rolled in a ball. And he took all the blankets. Hey, said Lula, waking up with a start. Harry, what are you doing? Asked Ted. I can't get to sleep, said Harry sadly. Harry looked out the window. He rubbed his tired eyes. What if sleep never ever comes at all, he said. Don't worry, Harry, said Lula. We're here, Harry. 
said Ted. What nice friends he has. The three little friends sat close together. They looked at the world outside. Lula sang a song to the moon. Ted counted the bright evening stars. They heard an owl hoot. Petals fell in the breeze. They felt the dew of the night. Harry snuggled up with Lula and Ted. His eyes felt heavy. He gave a big yawn. <gasps> Good night, Harry, said Lula. Sweet dreams, Harry, said Ted. But Harry was fast asleep and snuffle was all he said. That must have been the owl they were looking at. So if you know what genre it is, then good job. And if you're not quite sure, it is a fiction. And remember, fiction means fake. And now you know. So good job for you. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this good night bedtime story. I'll have another one up and coming. I'll talk to you soon. Miss you all. Bye.